Hello, and welcome to Network Storage Tips. In this short video, we're going to be talking about small business network storage. Now, depending upon the size of your organization and how long you've been storing data, something like this might look real familiar to you. These machines that this particular unit probably cost around $4,000 when it was brand new, and it's been a reliable machine for us. It's very capable, and it's still uh, running well today. But as you can see, it's rather large, it's rather noisy, it takes up a lot of space and you have to have it uh, in an air conditioned environment because it will generate some heat. And there are a lot of disadvantages to having a machine like this, on top of which is you pretty much have to buy some expensive licensing from Microsoft in order to do anything with the box. Now contrast that to a little machine like this from Netgear, it's a ReadyNAS, and this happens to be an NVX, and it will do pretty much everything this huge monstrosity will do for a lot less money. And the software that it comes with will allow you to do what you want to do for free. You don't need to buy any expensive licensing from Microsoft. Whether it be file sharing, media streaming, or even an iSCSI target. Maybe you started to get into VMware or some other virtualization, maybe virtual PC. This box will do all of that and it can have built into it as much storage in a RAID protected array as what this larger model typically be configured with. But as you can see, it's not going to use near as much power, make near as much noise, generate hardly any heat, and doesn't take very much space either. And if you happen to have an equipment rack, well the same unit comes in a different configuration, this rack mount, and you get the same features, same benefits for about the same cost. So whatever it is that best fits your needs, you can probably find it in a network storage device that is not something like this. And while all these machines have been real, real reliable for us in the past, that doesn't mean we want to go forward in the future with a bunch of these around when we don't have to. Well, that's what network storage is all about. And we have the information here on our website to help you make a decision as to what type of network storage might be appropriate for your small business. We've got reviews, comparisons, we've got how-tos for those units that you already own or if you uh, are buying one and want to get started with it. And we can also field your questions if there's something that we haven't covered that you need to know. That's what we're here for. So thanks for stopping by. Hope you find what you need. We have a lot of information here and we are updating it frequently. So with that, I'll let you get started.